Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, there's a quick way to have access to all of your apps that you have on your PC in Windows 10 and Windows 11. It works for both uh, computers, both systems, so if you're on Windows 10 it also works. Uh, it's just that the app menu will be different um, in the settings. So of course you can go into your settings and go to the apps section that definitely is one option in the settings where you can go to apps. It's quick, but you still aren't exactly at apps and features. You have a few clicks to do. Two ways, very simple ways. One with the mouse, one with a keyboard shortcut, bring you to the same place. If you locate the Windows key on your keyboard on the bottom left, hold it and press the X at the same time, you will have the what some people call the secret start menu, which is the um, different options that you are and that you have available from the start menu. You can also do the same thing by simply right clicking the start button. Here you have access, very quick access to apps and features and brings you directly to where your apps are. If you have to uninstall an app, if you want to do something um, you know, find out what version of an app you have or whatever. Everything is in here and you can, of course, at the right side, click three little dots. You have different options. Depending on the app, you'll have different options. Some have advanced options. Some have the possibility to uninstall. Uh, it all depends on what you're actually doing and what type of app it is. And it is here that you can, of course, set your default browser at the same time. Um, in the, uh, of course, um, aspect that you might want to have a option, you know, a, um, an app that would be a default app. So the, the app list is here. Everything is in there and you can uninstall from here. There are apps that will bring you to the control panel programs and features for uninstall. It depends on how the app has been actually done, but most of the apps will uninstall from here and you have access, quick access to the uh, app list uh, if needed in this place here. And of course, you can search for an app like, for example, Chrome. You'll go to the Google Chrome and you'll have the app available here. You got the three dots here in this case, modify, uninstall is what it brings you. But of course, um, where you want to have apps sometimes is also the default apps that you can access quickly by going to apps on the left and then default apps here. Um, I got to say that the apps should have been, and that should already have been like that, that here you can, from the apps and features and the three dots on the right side, they should have already given us the possibility to put an app as a default app, but you know, Maybe someday. I wonder if somebody has, has asked that um, of all the apps that are available, um, if somebody, you know, just wants that to happen. So anyways, this is the way it works, and it gives you access directly to all the apps and info that you need quickly. So keyboard shortcut, Windows key with the letter X, or like I said, right click on the start button apps and features is at the top. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.